Hello, everybody, and welcome to the newest feature at the Better Business Bureau serving Western Virginia. I'm Brad Salois, PR specialist, and I'm glad to be here with you discussing what's new at your BBB this month. Let's start off by discussing the new law affecting credit freezes. Data security is an all-too-common issue in recent years, with breaches at retailers, health insurance companies, and credit bureaus affecting millions of consumers. In this situation, the most important thing to do is to initiate a freeze on your credit. A freeze prevents new credit from being issued in your name, and thankfully, placing a freeze has been made much easier in recent weeks by a new law that requires the three nationwide credit reporting agencies in the U.S., Experian, Equifax, and TransUnion, to allow consumers to freeze and thaw their credit report free of charge. Before this law, freezing your credit was governed by Virginia law and allowed credit reporting agencies to charge fees. Credit freezes also had to be placed and lifted at each agency individually, making the process cumbersome and time-consuming. The number of situations requiring a credit check, upgrading your cell phone, applying for a job, signing a new lease, etc., made freezing and unfreezing your credit impractical. As a result, many people did not bother with a freeze unless they believed they were specifically at risk for identity theft. With this new legislation, you still have to place a freeze at each of the three credit bureaus, but they now have online portals that will make the process much simpler. When a credit reporting agency receives an online or phone request to freeze someone's credit, they are required to have the freeze in place within one day. Requests to unfreeze or thaw someone's credit report must be completed within one hour of the request. These stipulations make it much easier to keep your credit frozen and only unfreeze when you need to apply for new credit. The new law also allows any parent to freeze their child's credit. A child's credit report is especially valuable to identity thieves since it is clean and often not monitored on a regular basis. If you are a victim of identity theft, the new law extends initial fraud alerts on your credit report from 90 days to one year and allows victims of identity theft to place a fraud alert on their credit reports for seven years. Over the next year, the credit reporting agencies are also required to provide free credit monitoring services to all active-duty military personnel. As always, for more information, check out bbb.org. Here at the BBB serving Western Virginia, we're thrilled to announce that we will be visiting regional colleges over the next few months in what we hope becomes a regular occurrence. Our visit schedule began in mid-October with a trip to Dabney Lancaster Community College in Clifton Forge, and we'll continue November 5th when we visit New River Community College in Dublin. Come out and see us when we're in your community. Folks, we want to remind you that we're available to speak to your group or events. We can talk about a number of different topics, including scams, identity theft, and ways you can be more aware on a daily basis. To book a speaker, give us a call at 540-342-3455 or 1-800-851-6869. With Halloween coming up, the BBB offers these tips to avoid getting spooked. Look around your home. Before you head out to your nearest Halloween store, check out what items you have in your home. You may find an old costume you can repurpose or Halloween decorations you can put out. Doing this will not only help you save money, but you won't end up with more than you need. Rent a costume. Some people don't like the idea of spending a lot of money on a costume that will only be worn once, which is why they look to renting. While renting a costume leaves more room in your budget, know that the costume you may be getting may not be in great shape. If you opt for renting a costume this year, check out the condition of the costume first and read over the rental agreement as needed. Look for sales. Compare prices on Halloween costumes and decorations from various retail and online stores. 
along with comparing prices, look for coupons and sign up for email alerts. This will help you get the best deals, saving you a nice chunk of change. Always check the return policy. Whether you are shopping in a store or online, always make sure you are clear on the store's return policy before you buy. Find out how long you must keep your receipt or what happens if you should lose your receipt. This will help you avoid any mishaps like unwanted items being non-refundable. Remember, buying a bunch of stuff with the intent of simply returning it after October 31st is considered fraud. Shop smart online. When shopping from an online website, the first step is to make sure the URL starts with HTTPS and includes a lock symbol. The S in HTTPS stands for secure. Look up the website's privacy policy and contact information. If it is not clearly listed or they have only an email as the point of contact, Take that as a big red flag and shop elsewhere. Also, be sure to use your credit card instead of your debit card, as credit cards not only provide additional protection, but it's easier to dispute a fraudulent charge. Seasonal Stores If you decide to shop from a seasonal store, ask whether or not they will be open after the holiday, how long they plan to stay open, and if they will accept returns after Halloween is over. If they plan to close up shop November 1st or refuse returns after, either consider shopping elsewhere or take more time to be sure that item is exactly what you want before making the purchase. Attending a special event or visiting a haunted house. Before you purchase tickets, do some quick research and make sure there are no complaints about the company hosting the event. We hope these tips help you avoid a spooky Halloween, and yes, we specialize in corny jokes. That'll bring things to a close in this month's BBB wrap-up at the BBB Serving Western Virginia. Once again, I'm Brad Salois saying thanks for listening, and as always, remember to visit BBB.org for more information and follow us on social media at BBB Western VA. Until next time, so long, everybody. This has been a production of the Better Business Bureau, serving Western Virginia.